morning, my friends. It's me again, your favorite dental wear. Hope everybody's doing okay today. Um, I already did the initial brushing of my dentures and everything this morning. I keep my mouthwash in a water bottle sitting on my counter. It's easier that way for me. I don't know if you do that, but it's just easier for me than trying to use that great big giant bottle. Anyway, let me finish this up. I'll be right back. All right, that was quick, wasn't it? Now, I've showed you my bottom denture a bunch. And looking at this on a camera, it looks like there's a good, good ridge in that denture. However, to be able to show you this properly, this bottom denture, I'm going to use this little this little comb thing here and you see this is this is really tiny I mean this is the length of my gosh I can't figure out how to do this okay that's the length of half of my finger okay this little part right here half as long as my finger so to this knuckle so all these little lines in there and I want to show you this just so you'll see that I have no ridge on my bottom denture. Look at this. How many lines disappear? One. One line disappears. Look at this. It goes to the first line. Now, you take this, that's about two inches long, and there are 25, 26, 27, 28, 29 lines in the middle of that. So, two inches, well, I'll do the math later, but that's just to show you how little ridge I have on my bottom. You take two inches and, and mark 29 lines in that two inches, and you'll see that right there is about as thick as my thumbnail, that one line. See that? Okay, so there's the line. There's my thumbnail, my thumbnail, okay? That's the thickness of my thumbnail. So, and this up here is just a little thicker than my thumbnail. So about the thickness of my thumbnail is how much ridge I have on this bottom denture. And I've tried to show that, but it, it's deceiving in the video camera. You see the valley and everything, and you're thinking, oh, he's got a great ridge. So let me show you the pictures of my actual gums. Most people, if you pull their bottom lip down, you can see their bottom gum. And this is what happens when I pull my bottom lip down. I'm going to throw some pictures up here of my bottom gums. And people always ask me how I can function without implants or whatever. Well, I've built up these muscles in my lip and my cheek. And I also use my tongue a lot to keep the denture in place. I can eat, I can drink, I can speak, I can sing, I can play instruments. Um, all without adhesive. And it's all because of learning how to function properly. Now you'll notice a lot of times when I'm talking on camera and things like that, you'll see me bite down because I have to press that bottom denture back down. I have no ridge on the bottom denture. So I've just learned certain techniques to keep it in place and certain ways of being able to function with it so that I don't ever have to worry about getting implants or anything like that. Check these pictures out and I'll explain to you. Well, I don't really need to explain. Just check these pictures out and you'll see there's no bottom ridge and there's one particular picture where you can see the dip in my bottom gum right here where there's basically nothing supporting that denture. showing that 
that, what I've done is showed you that even if you have the tiniest ridge, if you can pull your lip down and see your bottom ridge, you've got more of a ridge than I do. I have learned how to completely function with that bottom denture with no adhesive, nothing. Even though it's what I call a floating denture. It basically just sits on the gum. There's hardly, in the back back here, I've got, you can see in the pictures that I have some ridge in the back, but there is nothing up here. That denture virtually sits flat right here in the front. And I've learned how to function with it properly. And if I can do it and not have to use adhesives and things like that, you can do it too. You just have to have a little more faith in yourself. You have to be a little bit more determined. You just have to be determined that you're going to make that denture work for you and learn that muscle control and learn the muscle control with the tongue. It takes time. It's not going to happen overnight. It takes time. It takes patience. But you can do it. Hope everybody has a fantastic day. Keep smiling, keep trying, and never give up.